what's up? You gonna help me? You gonna help me make a cake? Hmm? Do you like treats? Do you like cakes? Do you? Yeah. Hello YouTube friends. Today's video we're going to be making an Appalachian apple stack cake with ingredients such as fresh ginger and sorghum molasses spiced with cinnamon and nutmeg. This fall favorite is sure to please this season. Let's get cooking. First, we're going to peel and chop finely two tablespoons of fresh ginger and set it aside. Chop it up finely in a food processor. In a bowl, mix together a half a cup of vegetable shortening with a half a cup of sugar until both are adequately combined.
Once the butter and the sugar are creamed together, add a half a cup of milk. And then add in one third of a cup of sorghum molasses. Add one egg beaten lightly. Then mix all the ingredients together until everything is mixed thoroughly. Scrape the bowl, making sure everything is incorporated nicely. and then give it one more mix. Add in a cap full of vanilla extract. And then sprinkle in cinnamon and nutmeg. Just eyeball it. Add in three and a half cups of all-purpose flour, a half a teaspoon of baking soda, and two tablespoons of fresh ginger. Mix until dough forms. Turn out onto a floured, clean countertop and knead at least until the dough takes form. Do not over knead. 
Light kneading is fine. Wrap the dough ball in plastic wrap. And chill in the fridge for one hour. While we wait on the dough ball to get chilled in the fridge, we can start on our apple filling. Peel, core, and slice up any apple of your choosing. We'll need about 10 to 11 apples. Add two cups of water to a pot on medium heat, bring apples to a boil, and reduce the water down until the liquid has evaporated. The apples should start to fry instead of boil. Add a third a cup of brown sugar, cinnamon, and nutmeg. Stir together. Take off heat and set aside. Roll out dough, not too thin or thick, and cut out with a round cookie cutter. Repeat process until dough is all gone. Poke holes in the dough shapes with a fork to prevent dough from puffing. Pop in the oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 8 to 10 minutes or until the dough is baked through. Transfer to a cooling rack to cool. Layer your stack cake by two layers, adding the apple filling to the top layer of each layer. Place assembled cake in the fridge once more for an additional two hours before serving. The apple filling will absorb into the cake layers so it will be soft and delightful. Fun fact! At holidays and weddings, early mountain settlers traditionally served stack cake, an alternative to more fancy and costly cakes. Neighbors, according to folk wisdom, would each bring a layer of the cake to the bride's family, which they spread with apple filling as they arrived. 